Make sure you have quite a bit of damage going on those dragon moves because you don't want them to kill the team. There we go. Oh crap. Oh jeez. No. We done posting quick. Oh, come on. It's close enough. Jeez. I think if I made two Tempests, that would actually be a pretty ridiculous team. I'm thinking of replacing Cassandra with Colt and using two Death Marks to kill this thing. <laughs> or Solus, for that matter. Cassandra needs an upgrade. I just use the upgrade. Okay. Okay. Alright. Hang on a sec. Gonna use that. That'd be good. Sorry about that interruption. Parents. <laughs> oh, we're getting a closer look, yeah? Alright, sold this quickly. What the heck is going on with my slow mo? <laughs> I 
wonder why Solus decides that it'd be a good idea to just try to act like this. Pharrellden Sniper. Solus. I think Cassandra can resist being stunned. Is actually pretty ridiculous. Constantly use your flasks as the tempest. You won't regret it. Whoops. Okay. I guess I guess I shouldn't be aiming at them then. Dragons are all dead. Good job, Sarah. <laughs> you did all the damage. Oh, yes. I need these. What the heck is that? Is that a helmet? actually that time now to actually finish the campaign but first skyhold well actually i think i need to go to skyhold regardless but yeah Just um, some warning, I will not be talking over the dialogue, so yeah. Screw that side quest, I'm just going through the rest of the game. I need to finish now. And probably the other operations, so. I think I'll just take control of Sarah and... Maybe make my character an assassin archer. A pleasure. Let's speak later. Another time. Still gotta think about what I need to do. That armor, I believe, is battle mage armor. And Knight of the Divine. <laughs> I think I'm going to put that on um, Solus. Give him that battle mage armor. Yeah, the 
das ist gut. Probably end up um, making a staff or something for good old Solus. Where's that operation at? There it is. All right. Okay, let's start. Um, I just... What happened in Adamant is a shame. I'm yeah. still reeling over the army of demons. Imagine what would have happened if the Inquisitor hadn't arrived. With right. an Illuvion, Corypheus could cross into the Thade in the flesh. Indeed. The Inquisitor can attest that these artifacts still work, if one knows how to use them. What happens when Corypheus enters the Fade? Why, he will gain his heart's desire and take the power of a god. Or, and this is more likely, the lunatic will unleash forces that tear the world apart. I won't allow it. I can't. Indeed, should Corypheus succeed, do not doubt you would be first to feel his holy wrath. Pardon me, but does this mean everything's lost unless we get to the Alluvian before him? Corypheus has a head start, no matter how quickly our army moves. We should gather our allies before we march. Can we wait for them? We should send our spies ahead to the Arbor Wilds. Without support from the soldiers? You'd lose half of them. Then what should we do? You overcome it, all three of you, together. Josephine, have our allies send scouts to meet us in the wilds. Liliana, your fastest agents will join them. Together, we'll have enough spies to slow down Corypheus' army until Cullen's soldiers arrive. <laughs> Such confidence. But the Arbor Wilds are not so kind to visitors. Old elven magic lingers in those woods. We'd be remiss to not take advantage of your knowledge, Lady Morgan. Please, lend us your expertise. Here's why I came here. Although it is good to see its value recognized. Any further instructions, Inquisitor? <laughs> the Inquisition began as a handful of soldiers. Thanks to you. We're now a force that will topple a self-proclaimed god. I could ask for no finer counsel, no better guidance. I speak for all of us when I answer. We could ask for no finer cause. We'll hound Corypheus in the wilds before he can find the temple or this Illuvian. Here we go. And for the rest of this, I'm also going to stop commentating because I'm tired of talking. <laughs>